perimeter secure. We're ready for takeoff. Hold down, Angel McDowell. piece of mail. <laughs> Your 10-year high school reunion. It'll be a fun night, Nat. Isn't that cool? It's great. Mm. I still can't believe that Nat and Peter are moving in together. Our little angels growing up. It's wild that Natalie owns property. The most expensive thing I own are these boots. Oh, excuse me, those are my boots. Whatever, my point is... I forgot my point. You broke your horny and you're wearing my boots. Thank you. Ah, so you thought you could escape my fortress. Not so fast. Ah! Oh my god! Jason! Surprise! Oh my god, are you okay? Yeah. That was fun. <laughs> fun. Yeah. <laughs> What are you doing here? I miss you. Look. Uh, what are you doing later? You know, after this. Later on. Jason, I thought we were on a timeout. What? We can't fool around at all? Hey, Jason. I didn't think you'd make it. Yeah. Yeah, photo shoot ran late. Plus, I, you know, wanted to miss all the heavy stuff. Hey, Jason. Hey. hey. Hey, how's the sequel going? Great, great. Yeah, we had like 13 writers, so it should be pretty good. Man, I loved the first one. Mm, yeah, it was great. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, but, uh, we get a great title for this one. Maximum Extreme 2. Oh, mm -hmm. oh the premiere's Friday, so I brought you guys some tickets. I love tickets! <laughs> oh. Hello? Yeah. Be right in. Thanks. Thanks for helping out, Jason. Yeah. yeah. Charlie. Bosley! What's happening, Angels? How y'all doing? Hey. Hey, Boz. Look here. I see my brother ain't checked the books in quite a while, huh? We have a book? Look here, lovelies. I know I've only been here for a few days, but one of you all explain to me, what the hell is this? Now, what do you think the hell? <laughs> Careful with that, Boz. I'm all right. <laughs> and I also see y'all being played. Five Gs for Kevlar vests? We need those. Yeah, they're made especially for us. What? You all fine, but you crazy. 
What? Bosley, come here. Have a seat, Boz. Okay, okay. Boz. What? Me. <laughs> you know, your brother, he didn't sweat the details. We do what it takes. That's right. So what does a Bosley do around here? He does the most important job of all. What's that? He connects us with Charlie. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Good morning, angels. Good, Good morning, morning, Charlie. Charlie. Bosley, I hope the angels aren't being too rough on you. Man, please, I date fat women. I'm talking about a couple of midgets. <laughs> Great work in Mongolia, angels. But I'm afraid the case has taken a new turn. God damn. Look, what the? Look, 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 look. Oh, I, <laughs> I know what I'm going to watch the game at tonight. <laughs> look, 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 look. Angels, I'd like to introduce Roger Wixon, senior director at the FBI. It's a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure. Hi. Hello. Over the years, the Townsend Agency has worked on several projects for the Bureau, but never one with so many innocent lives at stake. Hey, I'm busy watching that dog on screen. <laughs> it's okay. Good job, Buzz. Angels, you're aware of the Federal Witness Protection Program. Sure, people who've testified against major crime figures are relocated and given new identities for protection. The identities of these witnesses and their families are protected by a program called HALO, Hidden Alias List Operation. The list is encrypted on two titanium rings. The data on each ring is indecipherable on its own, but when the two rings are read together, their codes unlock each other. Who wears the rings? The head of the U.S. Marshal Service was wearing one. Ray Carter. Good morning. Hey, how are you feeling? A couple of fractured ribs, but I'll live. Who wears the other ring? The head of security for the Justice Department, William Rose Bailey. Unfortunately, he was killed this morning, and now both rings are in the open. So the list is out. You may be right. We know someone has contacted the major crime families with an offer to sell the list. And one of our protected witnesses, Alan Caulfield, was found dead in his home in the valley. Angels, we need to get the halo rings back before the list is sold. We'll start at the Caulfield house. See if that leads us to Halo. Hey, Charlie, we could really use Bosley's help on this one. You get to drive the race car? Not today. You the Global Castle? Not yet, Boz. What would y'all need me to do? Hmm. Read some body language. Hell. 